Hey guys, and welcome back. Well, Carrie Kelly, uh, R. Kelly's brother, gave a recent interview uh, to discuss further details about his infamous brother allegations against him. Now, he also claimed that he indeed married um, Aaliyah at 15 uh, when he was 27. And when it came up asking him, did he think his brother was a pedophile? He said he didn't know about that. He said uh, he, he definitely has a control problem. He said he loves his brother, uh, but he does have a problem. And that if anybody loved him, they would make him go get help. Now, he also recounted uh, the conversation uh, he had with his brother after his acquittal from um, his 2008 case about, you know, when he pissed on the little girl and that, that infamous tape, that trial. And he said that he called um, R. Kelly and said, hey, man, God gave you another chance, you know. God gave you another chance. And uh, according to Kerry, uh, R. Kelly's reply was, God didn't give me nothing. I gave me another chance. My money gave me another chance. Huh? Yeah. Well, arrogant uh, bastard. But, oh, excuse me. But, um, you know, after that, he just said, my brother, he, he said he looked at the phone. I guess he was like, this guy is crazy. And, uh, you know, he continued about recounting the aftermath of the trial. And uh, it's alleged that R. Kelly even molested his own daughter. Yeah. Now, uh, they're going to be his daughter, I guess, and the family. Uh, Andrea, his ex-wife, they will be on uh, Iyanla's Fix My Life, which R. Kelly refused to appear uh, because he won't admit it. But uh, I do know uh, that his uh, daughter is now a um, a trans. Uh, you know, she's a, a guy and now. And, uh, hmm, you know, that's that's just awful. I mean, watching Surviving R. Kelly, I couldn't even watch it all. I mean, it was... <laughs> but now the allegation that he molested his own daughter, oh, man, come on. This man needs to be... You know, I don't think it... You know, and I, 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 I hate to say that, but I don't think it's no help for this Negro. I really don't. Uh-uh. He's in denial. And the more, um, you know... They talk about him and allegations, the more he's doing. <laughs> this guy has to be stopped. But anyway, and you know, his record label, I think it was Sony, they dropped him last week. So, you know, he's not going to last for long. So, uh, I mean, I'm like with his brother. If anybody loved him or around him or whatever, they need to tell him, you know. His people need to tell him, hey, man, you need to get help. You need to give apologies. You need to be sincere. Because <sighs> I think this guy is going to end up going to prison. And, you know, they don't take nicely to uh, child molesters. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. Hope you will like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as always important, be blessed.